Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Again, my name is Fonz and if you are new to this channel, then welcome and consider subscribing. I do lots of contact lens reviews, beauty product reviews and random videos on the internet. So for those that do know me, I love contact lenses and I do contact lens reviews every single week. So I'm constantly touching my eyeball, uh, taking out the contact lens, putting in the other one and so forth every single week. So over time it has irritated my eyes. So I want to go see my uh, optometrist, my eye doctor, and just to make sure that everything's okay with my vision. And also because I started noticing that my eyes started to get a little bit irritated. I would notice that they were uh, reddish. Uh, you can see the little veins here and there, especially with the 4K camera. So I went to my doctor and he was able to verify that nothing's wrong with my eyes. He says that it's because of a lot of lack of sleep. I'm usually very tired or I'm exposed in the sun a lot and that's what's causing uh, my eyes to be a little bit irritated. I did mention to him that I'm a contact lens user usually daily since I wear clear contact lenses and he also said that may be a reason why my eyes also get irritated for the uh, the lack of oxygen but he didn't prohibit me from using contact lenses he pretty much told me to get some rest and not be in front of a screen for so so long which is kind of difficult because that's my job I'm always on the computer or uh, on a screen so that's gonna be a little bit difficult so I was asking him if there's any remedies for me to um, for me to get rid of this redness and at first I thought he was going to recommend what I'm using which is a uh, Visign or Sustain. Uh, Sustain, I have no idea how to pronounce these, but they are over-the-counter um, retinas relief for the eyes and he told me to completely stay away from these and I was like, why? And he said it has something to do with, uh, with the active ingredients. It kind of makes uh, your eye get red again once you stop using it, so your eye kind of gets addicted to uh, the, the chemicals that are here. He says on some people it works, on some people it doesn't, but I will recommend staying away from those. So I asked him if there's anything cheap over the counter that he would recommend and he told me, have you heard of Lumify? Which is this product right here. I have not tried it. This is the very first time I'm gonna try it out with you guys. Um, but he said that uh, a lot of his uh, patients have been using this product and they've seen instant, instant uh, uh, relief and difference as soon as they put an eye drop in their eyes and it's not something that becomes addictive. He of course did tell me that there's some prescription medication but that's a little bit too pricey for me at the moment so that's why I asked for something cheap over the counter. So it says instill one drop in the affected eyes every six to eight hours. Do not use more than four times daily. Remove contact lenses before use. Wait at least 10 minutes before reinserting contact contact lenses after use. So if you are a contact lens user and if you want to have bright eyes, do not immediately put your contact lens on. Let it sit for 10 minutes and then you can put on your contact lenses. So let's see what this whole thing is about. Am I even in sync? I can't even see. Oh, I think I put one. I think I did. Let's try the other eye. Uh, sorry, this is so difficult for me. Okay, there's, there's another one. So I'm gonna close my eyes and let the product work. I'm gonna try not to, uh, I'm gonna try not to stop the video. That way, um, that way is more realistic in real time. So let's see, apparently it says that it's supposed to work in like 60 seconds to two minutes, which I don't know if that's true, but I've seen videos where it does, but I mean every person is different, so. So let's just wait, 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 wait. Are you guys seeing a difference? Uh, it did not burn at all. It didn't, um, I didn't feel anything. It just felt like any other uh, eye drop or, you know, very moisturizing, lubricating. Uh, this, uh, what's it called? This thingy majiggy, this Lumify, it's not supposed to be used as a moisturizer. So do not 
Use this as a moisturizer when you feel that your eyes are dry. Do not use this. This is just for, I guess, cosmetic purposes. If you want your eyes to be a little bit brighter for an event or if you're going to work, I don't know, maybe you're high or something and you just want to, you know, cover it up, use one of these. Are you guys seeing a difference? I cannot see since I don't have my contact lenses, but let me get a mirror. Oh, oh yeah. Okay, now that I put my glasses on, and I'm looking at the screen, I can totally see a difference. Oh my God, guys, look at that. Look at that. <laughs> oh my God, my eyes. They look so shiny and pretty. <gasps> totally see a difference. It is white, not pale, pale, pale white, but it did reduce the redness of my eye by a lot. I totally, totally recommend this product. Of course, this is my first time using it, so. All right, guys, so there you guys go. This is the shot from far away. I'm gonna try to do a before and after, that way you guys can see the difference of these eye drops. So overall, I am very, very satisfied with uh, Lumify. Of course, any product that you use in excess can become dangerous. So make sure to go to your eye doctor first if you notice that you have some irritation or red eyes, okay? This may be a solution to, uh, of, to for the outside, but only your doctor can diagnose you if you have something internally. And for me, thank goodness that nothing was wrong with my eyes and I had the green light to use Lumify. So you should do as well. Again, thank you so much for watching my video. If you found this helpful, please give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and again, take care and I will see you guys next time.